Okay, so this morning I put in the front wall. Kind of. Yeah. It's like four sticks. But it roughly outlines the uh, the garage doors and, and blah blah blah. Ow. Um, so I put that in. I only put in the king studs. I left out the jack studs and the headers. And the reason I did that is so that I can do them later. Not because I like to put stuff off, but because I'm not quite sure what doors I want to use or what size they're going to be. And, oh, and I don't really want to take the time to research it right now. And to find it and to... And I didn't actually include those garage door headers in the uh, lumbar quote. Ah, yes. Good morning. I still have a morning voice, and so I'll be narrating in a slightly different accent. Uh, here you can see I am installing studs to frame out the garage doors, you see. Uh, I needed to do this so that I could support the rim for the floor, the second floor, above the garage base. Here you can see I will be cleaning up a little bit, as it's difficult to work when there's tons of stuff in your way. Uh, what I'm doing here is installing four studs connected together uh, to form posts to carry the weight of the rest of the garage down through the floor, through the walls, in fact. Uh, here I'm adding a double top plate. Oh, I know I originally said that I wouldn't build a double top plate because I could save lumber. But in the end I realized that, in fact, Having a double top plate is only 10 boards, and that's really not that much, and it also adds a lot of strength, uh, especially in walls, where I built windows with 2x8s that are 80 inches long, which I think is grossly inadequate now thinking about it after the fact. So I believe the double top plate will add just a little bit of strength, so that I can feel a little more comfortable about having those spans. So here... I've installed the posts in the front wall, which is why I had to frame out the garage doors in the first place, so that I could get the posts in. Here, actually, is the cleanup of my garage. The first time, actually, that I ever cleaned my garage. It was a monumental occasion, I do say. Uh, and look, now I am completely ready to start the next phase. 